All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to expedition number 62. We are Bradford PA Bigfoot Research Group, and we're going to give you the best we can on this expedition. Where we're going, we're going to the Allegheny State Park, which is in New York, and we're going to check this one area out, this drag, I call it a drag area, where there's no campers, there's just hiking trails in that area, and we're going to make sure that there's not any hikers on the trails and we're gonna get as close as possible to the main road but yet be in the woods you know what I mean Because a lot of people have said that they have seen Bigfoot cross the road a lot and then there's a creek that runs literally straight up around that right up the middle and there's the main road too and there's also walk trails so we're gonna see just what's going on in the Allegheny State Park. So, join us, shall you? Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we're Allegheny State Park right now. Turn that down. And uh, we're looking around. We got Devin with us. Rolling, man. And uh, there's some campers over here. Ooh, wow, there's a bridge. Wow. Uh, there's some campers over here at the cabins, but I don't know if the tent area. While we're over here, we'll probably just take a little gander up that way. See if the tents are open, but it, they might be. You can see some of the people over here. I mean, it's very interesting that uh, it's open the way that it is. Let's see if these people are wearing their masks. You can see some of the people, I mean. But they're spaced out pretty good, though. Yeah, they got the mask on them. They got the mask on them. What we did is we flew the drone. We flew the drone all the way out through this area out through here. Flew it out through this way and we f we spotted something on on the drone over this way. We don't know what it was, but when I get back and uh, analyze the data, uh, we'll find out. But it was drone flying time and it was pretty cool. So check out the footage, good stuff. So, okay, so the next location where we're going to go is 
um, the whole drag when you pass the when you pass the the campgrounds, all the campgrounds, that whole flat drag by the science fiction lake. We've had a lot of activity up through there in the past. Towards about right now, a lot of the hikers come out of the woods. Squatches go in. Okay, folks. So we're just moving our way up through this way, and uh, we're gonna be checking. Uh, Oh man, a few spots here. I just don't know if we should hit this one first. I kind of want to wait until dark to hit this one. Uh, I mean, yeah, that's been dry recently too. So you gotta put that in a cup. I just don't know if we should just go here first and then work our way up yeah. it's been really dry but we are in it too yeah. you're gonna walk the fuse now you turn the yeah I don't want to do that I mean I, I, there's nowhere to park yeah. up there at the you know the horse thing you know what I mean? We were gonna quit last time. Oh, Trying to cram it all in my brain, I can't think. Okay. So now, ladies and gentlemen, we're just moving up here. We heard thumps that we're back that way across the road. Very distinctive hitting the ground thumps after Devin and Nick through rocks on the ground and across the road and then all of a sudden we heard that we also possibly heard a distant roll sound but unfortunately, I had technical difficulties with my other camera, so I never got it on film. Good old fashioned technology. Actually just moving our position into uh, another area that uh, is a, a relevantly good hot spot. So that's what we're doing right now, and uh, let everybody know on the activity. It happens. Oh my gosh. So. Is that legal in VA? So that is a moped, folks. Yeah, that dirt bike? Take it out. There's air. It was like, or something. It was some type. <laughs> okay, so, so folks, what we heard was it was it was a moped backfiring. It wasn't a gunfire, so that was kind of stupid all the way around. The whole thing was all right. Let's head out this way. All right. Well, let's just. I mean, I mean, it doesn't hurt to be cautious, especially in this time. Right. All right, folks, we're heading out. What a weird night. Heading out Indian Pipeline Trail here. Gonna see if uh, we get any activity. Um, apparently, the um, the activity that uh, we apparently had, we possibly gunfire, was a moped backfiring which we thought it was gunfire. <laughs> but we took caution. Yeah, you turned on that IR, did you? Yeah. That picks everything up quick. And then my IR's on, too. So. 
one of the very first places that I went to past years been pretty quiet up here. I mean, they're around, but they just don't really show themselves as much as they used to. It's like they're afraid or something, I don't know. But uh, this is where my buddy had that uh, zap, he got zapped on the info sign. Seen a whole tree move. Pump it. Pump it. Pump it. Still. Pump it. We got pump it. My hair's going straight up. Straight ahead of us. Is it going up the side? It's right over there by those peepers, right? We got some walking over our right. I just heard it walking. Hear it walking?
see what they do. And we can move up a little bit up into that light. This is freaking crazy, too. All the way around. It is. Oh! Did you? I didn't kick it. Did you kick that rock? I didn't kick that. I swear to God, you, I don't. I'm warm. I've been picking those feet up. Is that whistle? Is that you? Is this going? Yeah, it's good. Rock just got thrown. We just heard it. I turned around. It was a good sized rock, too. None of us were walking either. No. Just heard a rocket thrown. You're a rocket throwing right here. Can you find can you find a caller or something? Blast it out. We just he also heard two distinct tree knocks by the car like far out that way. Yeah, go with it. If you can go as loud. Clam. I'm gonna clam. I'm gonna slam one of these trees over here. Alright, I'm gonna hit this tree right here, folks. Let's see what we get.
We've got two rocks thrown at us. One was thrown behind Nick. Nick will tell you in a minute. And Devin's been playing this train app through the microphone. Megaphone. And it's on YouTube and it's real loud. And we heard three distinct tree knocks in the valley. And we're not even what, guys? We're not even a hundred yards up from the vehicles? Yeah. And we heard a lot of movement. Like walking movement. Down here in the valley. And we also heard movement up behind us. Now well, there was a vehicle that drove out this dirt road and went further out. And this dirt road goes like four miles, five miles out. So it could, I don't know what they were, what's going on, but I mean they drove pretty far out. It was a pickup truck, a white truck. So, sounds like another vehicle's going out too as well. Interesting. Party time. Yep. Yeah, you know what that means. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back to the we're back to the vehicle. Um, there's a lot of uh, vehicles that drove out this dirt road, so we're like, ah, we'll just cut it. Uh, it's getting late anyway, so it's actually early. It's our crunch time anyway, so uh, we're just gonna. Um, go around the table here and uh and seeing the experiences that we had bigfoot on expedition 62 well i almost got hit by a rock don't know where that came from it was pretty cool startling i was walking right behind jason after uh was after we heard the knocks mm -hmm. we heard the knocks then Devin did the call blast and and right after he stopped, we, me and Jason both turned around. I was behind him walking, and the rock landed right behind me. and almost hit me. It was like, it was like, what's that? Yeah, <laughs> literally had to turn around. Oh shit! I'm oh, sorry, pardon the language. <laughs> but yeah, and then we heard, we heard the knocks. That was pretty cool. Heard, I heard the two distinct knocks. Heard boom, boom. Then we heard all the thumping and walking around out here, and then got ruined by a party. Partied out. <laughs> yeah. So. Was, good night. So, uh, what what was your uh, experience in the Allegheny State Park? As much as time as we had there. Uh, we all we heard quite a bit of thumping and stuff around on the other side of the street mostly. We didn't see nothing, but okay, I'm not sure what it could have been. Okay. All right. So, uh, what do you think about the drone fly, though? We tr oh, we awesome. tried that yeah, out. I want, a, I want a drone now. That's Even something more. new. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Yeah. Okay, so um, we have Devin here. What do you think, Mike? There's definitely something out here. I would say probably about two. Okay. On the left or the right of our where we were at walking? Both. Okay. Because at first I heard it to the right, probably about two, 250 yards out. But then I heard it to the left, and that's when the peeper stopped, and I was like, yeah. Something to and then they kept coming on and off. That yeah, was kind of odd. Really quiet at one point. Yeah. yeah. Whistle. Very... Right. I mean, you know, peep or those. The peep, and then it stopped, and then I started hearing the movement off the left, and it moved on to our rear side, trying to find our wind. Mm -hmm. But I kept hearing Smell us, off yeah. to the right, too. So there, I definitely think there was two squatches out here, and they were pretty close. But then I blasted some of the Redding Six Chime whistle. Yeah, it was like a, a train, almost yeah, like six chime whistle off the, the Ohio Howl, almost like. Yeah, they came off the T1 Northerns. Okay. And all of a sudden we had that knock, two of them. That was incredible. Yeah, that was incredible. Wow. And then the rocks started getting thrown. How many rocks do you think total? I mean, what was going on? What do you think? That got thrown at us? Yeah. Well, we had the one, that one we got here first guy here walked up the road and then we were standing at that one spot and we both turned around and I almost got hit by the one. So it like hit behind you, right? Literally yeah. right behind us. Well, I'm walking and really right behind me then rolled. Wow. 
So, so per, so much precision that we didn't even know where it was coming from. It was no, so, I have no idea where it came from. I literally couldn't literally, tell you. Like, couldn't even hear it coming through the. Literally just hit the ground and rolled. That's so freaking crazy how that is. And then the tree knocks after you were running, you know, the the train call. Until we meet again. Later, everybody. <laughs>